Okay, my name is Mark Vandermeer and I've got a small sawmill in Missoula, Montana. And uh, this is the mill right here. It's a real simple machine. It's called a Brand X. It's a swing saw. It uh, works on both the horizontal and the vertical. It's horizontal there. Vertical. Put the log down there and then you swing the carriage over it like this. It makes lumber pretty quick and pretty accurate. And uh, not a whole lot of trouble with this mill. We've had it for uh, six years and we've used it hard, much harder than this mill was uh, meant to be used. We, cut, we probably cut around 65,000 board feet a year with this. Um, there's a lot of advantages of a circular saw uh, and, and a few disadvantages. One of the main advantages is it sharpens quick and easy. It's uh, got a five tooth blade on it and I can sharpen it in about 90 seconds. Uh, a band saw, you can't do that. This thing doesn't waver at all when you're cutting through, so it's, it's a nice, accurate surface on, on everything we cut. We can mill up to 24 feet long, and any size of beam you can imagine, and we uh, and and down to almost any size too. We cut we cut wood down to a four-inch top. Uh, minimum length is about six feet. Uh, we use these in all kinds of settings. We've got uh, three track setups in Western Montana. Uh, one, one in Missoula, one in Arley, and then one up in the Swan Valley. We transport this power head around with our, um, and then we uh, combine that with a small tractor, a farm tractor. And so it, we found it's a lot easier to haul dry boards around than it is wet logs. And, uh, and plus it gives us an excuse to go mill somewhere else. And that's been working real well. Uh, most of our sites where we do our milling is completely off the grid, a long ways from anybody. And we kind of specialize in, in uh, milling and building for people in places like that. Since this is gas powered, we don't need any electricity. And uh, our other equipment is all um, diesel powered. All the trees that we use here come from either an urban setting, right in Missoula, or from our forest restoration projects. Uh, that's the foundation of our business, is ecological restoration. So the whole sawmill side of this thing is just making use of a byproduct. We didn't want to get into the sawmilling at all. But the logs that we take out are so ugly and, and so valueless uh, that the big mills don't want them. So, um, but we know different and we just uh, just jumped into it and so far it's been working real well. You can buy this stuff at, uh, at our retail outlet at Home Resource or you can stop by down here, I guess, if it's a bigger job. The way we really sell wood is we design small buildings for people, sheds and barns and cabins and whatnot. And so we design those and build them. And, uh, and we find that's the best way to really make the best use of, of these logs. If you like this sort of thing, come on out to the forums at permies.com, where we talk about woodland management, homesteading, and permaculture all the time. Thank you.